video, I'm going to show you how to estimate for just a slope replacement. Sometimes we have damage um, only to one slope or maybe two slopes, so uh, we don't need to replace the entire roof, but it's enough damage to warrant replacing that, uh, that one slope. So what I've got here is just a small roof that I've drawn in sketch, and there's two ways that we could estimate for a slope. Um, one is we can type in the selector code here, or you could even search. We're going to say this is a 25 year three tap shingle. And what we can do is drag that over the slope that's damaged and just click there. And you'll see that it's placed in our sketch um, the removal and replacement of the shingles. Um, and then from here, what we can do is we'll go over to Estimate. And we're not using RFG 240 Remove. What we're going to do is use ARMV, which is the Tear Off, Haul Off, and Dispose of Comp Shingles. So we're going to replace that. We also need to go in here and replace the felt. And we're always going to go back with 30 pound. And if you look here, you'll see the calculation for just the slope that we replaced. And so that calculation is F3 slope, or F3 square. And we'll click OK. And we'll move that up just a tad. And for the roof shingles we're going to need to add waste. The easiest way to do that is to click on this little box right here next to the calculator and since this is a gable roof we're going to select 10% waste. And of course we would need drip edge so we'll hop back over here to the sketch and we'll see what the measurements are for this particular slope. So we have 11.6 plus 6.2 right here, which is what our drip edge would be. So we'll go back into estimates, and we'll do RFG drip. And then we're just going to add in those dimensions that we just measured. And it comes out to 17.67 linear feet. And if you had any vents, uh, pipe jack boots, any of that stuff, you would add it right here onto that slope, but then um, after we finished, what we could do is we'll just make an F9 note saying the above items are for the replacement of the front right slope of the roof. And that way it tells the insured and the contractor exactly what we're paying for. And we're good to go.